What's going on guys? Welcome to another video. So for today's Google Apps Script series, um, we're going to talk about uh, the one of the functionalities that we can do in Google Apps Script is of course to make calculations. And of course with that, you can sort of create shortcuts in your spreadsheet. And this is actually based on a request by one of the member and the the email that i received from the member is on tax calculation so he did share his uh, structure and his use case and of course by completing his request i asked the permission to share the script to all of you and he said yes so this is the video on it and we will run deep on what it does and how to do it and it's quite simple i guess so not to worry uh, the script thing part would be a bit overwhelming to some but not to worry uh, i'll provide the script in the description down below but here's how it works so without further ado let's check it out all right guys so uh, google app script can also do calculations for you and i got a question uh, i got an email actually to be more specific uh, someone asked me on is it possible to do tax income income tax calculation using google apps script so yes i provided him the script but i want to share this with you as well so this is the use case i got so they, he's doing a study on the taxations between countries uh, so this is the table that i managed to extract which is the country income range tax rate and deduction and i have another sheet called income data so based on the country and the income of the particular individual we want to sort of calculate the tax i mean normally you can do using the normal formula but uh, the person requested for a script so which i did and this is the script that i provided to him and now i'm sharing it with you as well so you can copy the whole script in the comment or uh, in the description down below and don't forget to change the spreadsheet id to your spreadsheet id itself this is mine so please don't use this because it won't work but if you're wondering how to get the spreadsheet id so simply go to your spreadsheet and in the url itself you can actually see your id so i'm showing you on screen right now this is mine but follow this step and copy your id and replace it in the code and of course save this project and run the selected function for first time you will be asked to provide permission i'll give you a warning and all that no not to worry just uh, simply allow the script to run so once you have run the script you will immediately see a tax calculator uh, option in your ribbon above and if i were to select the tax calculator and calculate the tax it will basically refer the income in column b in the income data sheet and based on the country that's been shown here okay so you can actually see uh based on the settings that you have it will definitely calculate based on that uh input so if i calculate the tax then there you go so this is the tax amount that needs to be paid by that person and if you were to update let's say uh tax from brazil will be zero till i don't know not really a big fan of tax not sure who is anyone here a big fan of tax <laughs> do let me know in the comment section down below so let's say we have brazil and we have uh added a new one so if I were to add Brazil here and let's say um, 25,000 
how to calculate the tax it will update as well so you can see uh, based on the income and the country which will refer back here it will take the, the percentage and deduction so of course the this helps the person that uh, that I mentioned earlier and he's happy about it so I hope you can also use the script to sort of help you with any case that you're facing but do let me know what else you would like to see when it comes to scripting and perhaps I could help you as well. So I hope you enjoyed the video. So uh, don't forget uh, to drop a like if you find this video useful and do subscribe if you haven't to see more contents like this. And of course, do let me know what else you would like to see or request in the comment section down below. And of course, just to uh, to give a shout out to the member itself for uh, supporting me uh, through the membership program. And of course, by being a member, your request is prioritized or they call it the VIP lane or fast lane per se. But not to worry for those who decided not to join, it's not really an issue for me. Uh, and since I'm not forcing anyone to do so. But of course, your support is more than welcome and always welcome. So until the next one, take care. Bye-bye.